I sat down and was asked a series of questions about the year I've just had and the year commencing. Welcome to the 2024 interview. Enjoy. Hello. Ooh, that is absolutely stunning. Creamy. Oh, that's horny. To, to, to 2023, I guess we'll start with the first question. What's your name? I'm Brad. What's your age? I'm 24. What do you do? Uh, I'm currently an IT um, nerd okay. that also makes YouTube videos on the side and slays pussy. How's life? Um, life's good. Life's really good. This year's been mental. Good question. I think right now, I think it's 108. 108. 108. I have 108 subscribers as of the end of 2023. 109. Oh, <laughs> you, you've only just subscribed? No, I haven't yet. <laughs> oh, well, soon to be 109 by the end of 2023. What's your favourite moment of 2023? Ooh, I have a lot. For the viewers, for the video, my favourite moment was meeting Sono. Uh, that was quite a good day, but probably going Bali is a big highlight. What are your plans for 2024? Um, I definitely want to make a lot more videos and find time to make more videos, um, as it is very time consuming, um, and pursue YouTube a lot more. I want to travel and experience a lot more um, culture. I want to do a lot of stuff that I never thought I'd do and try loads of new things. Say yes to a lot, say yes to everything. What are your New Year's resolutions? One, to cut down a lot on drinking. Yeah. I'm gonna try dry Jan. Definitely never smoking or vaping ever again. Uh, th those are the two big ones. I really wanna focus on my fitness mm -hmm. and my, my running. I wanna do some events. So I wanna do, my, my checklist is a 5K, 10K, 15K, half marathon. Maybe a marathon, but I didn't. I didn't like the last one I did. I want to do a triathlon. That'd be sick. Good question. I want to read a book a month. I want to read at least twelve books a year, this year, which would be very interesting to come back to this in a year's yeah. time. So, Brad, read twelve books, please. Oh, audio books count as well. Sorry, Lando's trying to get under the duvet and it's knocking the uh, the light. What's one thing you told yourself a year ago? What's one thing I would tell myself a year ago? Maybe start picking up a camera quicker than I did. Um, or actually doing something. I've always struggled with the doing. I've always had the, the plan and then I've never done the doing. Um, so like starting a business through lockdown and stuff where I bought and sell clothes. I, I, I did it, but I didn't put 100% into it. I wasn't, I, 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 Hundred putting hundred percent into something that I do, and not being seventy percent or eighty percent, going full all in, all or nothing, regardless if it fails or not. I wish I did that. What's something you tell your future self? Th this is for him in a year's time. This is quite weird because like I'm thinking about me sitting in this exact place. Well, it won't be in the exact place. I'll be in a fucking. Hopefully I'll be in a fucking balcony in Dubai or something with my mansion. What would I tell my future self? Keep smiling. Don't stop smiling. Regardless. Just stay positive. What are you most proud of? What am I most proud of? I'm very, I'm hypercritical of myself because I, I feel like I'm, I've done a lot in my life and I think almost like meh. No, it's, so, it's almost like I've done so much and, and, and like experienced loads that uh, sitting here I can't even think of anything because it's not, it's not anything pinnacle in my life. Mm. I'm, I'm proud of the fact that I'm the person that people go to um, for happiness and humour and not to offload but like to, I'm a good person to be around vibe wise. People feel safe and secure around me. Mm. I'm not creepy. I'm not, like, I'm not that weirdo, you know what I mean? What do you want to feel proud of next year? I just want to uh, not impress people, not, not because I, I, I need the validation, but just... Uh, what am I trying do to say? Do you want to inspire people? That's the word I was looking for, yes. Because I feel like I have, by the way. 
I honestly feel like I have inspired people. As soon as I turned on a camera and started recording and stuff like that, people were there like, oh my God, I want to do that. Like, I, I, I want to be that person where people know me and have known me for me before I, before I ever like, picked up a camera and stuff. And then they see me doing this, doing that, and doing this, and think, oh, if he can do it, I can do it. That's what I want to be. I feel like this, this question is sort of one of them ones where regardless of my answer, it's out of my control. What do I want 2024 to bring me? Um, prosperity. I have no idea what that word means. No, like good vibes from everyone. Anyone I meet, I want like a good time. What inspires you? Good question. I've never thought of this either. Some people have like a figure or like two or three people that inspire them and stuff, but I feel like I've always had the inspiration from me. I've always wanted to, I've always looked in the mirror and wanted to better myself. So I feel like I get the inspiration from me not doing as good as I should be. Is that a good answer? Yeah. I don't know if that's a cop out. I've got a good question. You've got a good question yeah. to close up. What's the best? Ooh, fuck bitches, get money. <laughs> um, the best piece of advice I've ever been given. That's hard, man. Because I've probably been given a lot of good advice and absolutely it's just gone over my head. Probably what my mum said to me is to put yourself first. Because if you're not happy, you can't make someone else happy. That's probably the best life advice. Not to make anyone cry. <laughs> um, yeah, I guess we'll wrap up there then. I think it's a nice thing to publish. Though. I think it'd be a good thing to post now. Yeah. Because it, one, this is I'm not going to put any music with it. It's literally just going to be completely no music, just the camera and the questions, and then the text come up when you're asking the questions. I think it's a good thing to go into 2023 with. And next year, what you can do is you can have this. Video and you can I can literally it. just watch it, yeah, and then cut it, cut and it up. You can be like, what's changed in here? Yeah, because I'll ask exactly the same questions. Yeah. To future me. Yeah. Future me. That's the questions over. Uh, to 2024. Hopefully, I'm not drinking any more Guinness because it will fuck me up, and my liver doesn't appreciate it. Tell you what, there's sex and then there's that. To 2024. It didn't stop frothing, it was just froth. That's like a nice gradient. <laughs> All right.